With a brand new OnePlus device, we also get brand new Oxygen OS features. In this video, let's talk about those new features and most importantly, older OnePlus devices will get some of these features as well. So hey guys, Dhan Jai and welcome back to a new video and let's get started. Gaming mode is improved even further with a new option to enable gaming display enhancement to enhance the details in dark areas and a special haptic feedback enhancement for games which supports haptic feedback in the gameplay. A special fanatic mode is present on the OnePlus 7 Pro which takes it one step further by disabling all notifications completely and to make sure you get the lowest ping, it will disable the second SIM card and give you the best latency possible. There is an easter egg here, just tap multiple times on the fanatic logo and write always fanatic and you will unlock these three wallpapers. Regular features such as disabling automatic brightness or optimizing CPU and RAM for best performance are obviously still here. Recording your PUBG, COD or Fortnite gameplay on the OnePlus 7 Pro is important because with this beastie hardware, nothing is going to lag and with the brand new inbuilt screen recorder which can record the screen in full HD resolution and at 20 Mbps of bitrate. And to top all this, it supports internal audio recording which means you can record the in-game audio. Here is a small example of the same. We are right now in a state where people meet in real life, talk for some time and end up on Instagram's search button. Zen mode is for these people who are literally addicted to their smartphones. Turn on Zen mode and now you won't be able to use the device for 20 minutes. It still allows you to call your emergency contacts and take a photo with the camera but this is a very good feature for those smartphone addicts to get rid of that addiction. OnePlus 7 Pro is having a huge screen and that's why this new quick way to reply messages will be helpful which loads the message or application on the left side and keyboard on the right side without pausing the video which was playing in the background. As soon as you take a screenshot, if you want to blur out some part or add arrows or highlight some part, then that can be done quickly by using the brand new screenshot editor tool. This is going to be very helpful for me personally. There are many new features coming real soon to Oxygen OS, which will be India specific such as cricket scores, caller identification, a new smart SMS app, OnePlus roaming and I'll probably make a video on them as soon as it gets released in the open beta which is scheduled for June 2019. Now quickly let's talk about some of the tips and tricks that I'm going to share with you. As OnePlus 7 series comes with 48 megapixel cameras, how do you shoot a 48 megapixel image? Simply open the camera application, click on pro mode and now click here and select 48 megapixel JPEG and boom 48 megapixel images will be clicked now. You can also click raw images by clicking on raw and then you can edit them in Snapseed application. By the way a raw image has a lot more detail as compared to a JPEG or JPG file. And that's why in a very challenging situation, I would highly recommend you to click in raw mode. You can lock apps individually by going into settings, utilities and then app locker. If you have added a fingerprint, then you can also use your fingerprint to unlock that application. If you want to improve fingerprint sensor performance, then add the same finger multiple times to make sure every inch of your thumb is covered. On OnePlus 7 series of devices, it shows you that this part is already covered in earlier fingerprint, so it forces you to move your finger and cover every single inch of it. And once you do this, you will have a seamless experience of unlocking the device. Digital Wellbeing is not installed by default, but you can install the APK which will be linked in the description box below. After that, install the Quick Shortcut Maker app. Once again, will be linked in the description box below. Open the Quick Shortcut Maker app, go to Digital Wellbeing, click over here and then click on Try. Now scroll down and select Show Icon in App List. Voila, you have working Digital Wellbeing as well as an app icon in the app list. Enable RAM Boost by going into System and RAM Boost to get the best app load times on your OnePlus device as these devices come with 6GB, 8GB or sometimes 12GB of RAM. You can change how ambient display looks by going into Settings, Ambient Display and customize it according to your wish. You can also add a custom message asking people to subscribe to your channel when you show off your new OnePlus 7 series of device like that's possible. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you loved the video, give this video a thumbs up. If you still have any more doubts, suggestions or queries regarding this video, do let me know about that in the comment section box below. So yeah, thank you guys. Thank you for watching.